It's time to start thinking about prom and another black history moment. We are Richmond and we are I'm Jordan Holthouse. We kick things off today with a special announcement from the prom committee. Hey everybody, by now you should have heard that prom is going to be on May the 14th from 8 to 11 p.m. Um, so since then people have been asking me what the theme is and I couldn't tell them. So what I want to do right now is reveal it so you all know how to dress because I think that's why everyone wants to know. So I need a drum roll. Um, the prom theme for this year is going to be Hollywood stars. So it's going to be lots of glitz and glam and fashion. It should be like lights flashing. It'll be really cool and fun. You should all come. Now, let's take a look at another Black History moment. The Medal of Honor is the highest military decoration any soldier can earn fighting for our country. In 1863, William Harvey Carney became the first African American to earn the medal, even though he was not awarded it until 1900. Carney won the Medal of Honor for heroism during the attack on Fort Wagner in Charleston, South Carolina. Despite serious wounds, Carney picked up the U.S. flag and marched forward until the Union forces were driven back. He then retreated with the forces before turning the flag over to another soldier before being treated for his wounds. Carney would be later honorably discharged for disability from the wounds he received that day. His only comment on the saving of the flag was, Boys, I only did my duty. The old flag never touched the ground. It's for his heroism that we make William Harvey Carney our Black History Month moment. Before we get into the announcements, we want to congratulate the RHS Ensemble who placed fourth in an Indiana Percussion Association competition recently. Good luck to them as they compete again this weekend at the Winter Guard International Competition in Greenfield. Now let's get into the announcements. HOSA will be hosting an organ donation drive today, tomorrow and Friday. Please consider becoming an organ donor. GSA will be meeting on Friday again this week. Meet after school in Ms. Hartman's room in R146. Students interested in getting one-on-one -on -one mentoring through the college application and admissions process should sign up for Earlham's Next Step Scholar Program. Students with questions should contact Mr. Ronnie in R314. Early college juniors and seniors interested in visiting the University of Indianapolis on March 10th or Indiana Wesleyan on March 17th should stop by Mr. Ronnie's room to sign up by Friday, February 25th. There is limited space, so interested students should hurry to reserve their spot. Another spring sport is having a call-out. Anyone interested in golfing for RHS, there's a boys golf call-out today after school in the McConaughey room in the Tiernan Center. And don't forget you can still be part of the RHS track team. Practices are going on now, Monday through Friday after school. Meet on the steps by the athletic office. Remember you must have a physical form on file to participate. Seniors, the next chance to get help filling your FAFSA test is coming up on February 27th. We'll have more information on that in, in a future show. The Red Devil players are looking for volunteers to work backstage for God's Spell. They need help with props, sets, sound, and lighting. If you are interested, contact Mix Bunner via Canvas. And a reminder for any junior or senior who signed up to go to the Wayne County Chamber of Commerce Career Fair tomorrow. There will be an all call at 9 a.m. to come to the cafeteria. Please dress appropriately. If you have any questions, see Mr. Hensley. We leave you today with some highlights from Friday night senior night at the RHS basketball game. That's your announcements. We're on the air. I'm Drayden Holthouse. Have a great day.